Let's start with writing down all of the constants and then uh, seeing what equation we might need to use to find the work done. So uh, the constant that we should all at least know how to find is the k constant, which is the same as one over four pi epsilon naught. And that is gonna be 8.99 times 10 to the ninth power, kilogram meters cubed over second squared coulomb squared. We know that the tiny charge that we're moving is 3.00 microcoulombs. We know that the large charge that we're moving it to is 20.0 microcoulombs. We know that we're moving the charge from a distance of infinity to a distance of 0 0.500 meters. And what we want to find is the work done. So we have our list of knowns and our one unknown. So the work equation that we have, uh, there's a few things. Work is force times distance, but the one that might serve us a bit better since we, um, let's see, since we don't have a direct relationship of force, we can use work equaling to the change in electric potential energy. So that's the electric potential energy final minus the electric potential energy initial. And that ends up being K, Q, big Q, so the two different Qs that we're comparing, divided by R sub F minus K, little Q, big Q, divided by R sub naught. Uh, we see first that the charge starts off at infinity. So R naught is infinity this whole term goes to zero. That means that we have now this term left over and we can fill in all the blanks, plug and chug. This is 0 0.500 meters. This is 20.0 microcoulombs. This is 3.00 microcoulombs. And this is the large number, 8.99 times 10 to the ninth kilograms meters cubed over second squared coulomb squared. So that's a little bit sloppy, but um, once you plug in all these numbers, plug it into your calculator and you're gonna get 1.0788 joules. Now, uh, it looks like we have three significant figures all around here. So we're gonna go ahead and turn this into three significant figures. That's gonna be 1.08 joules. So this is the work it takes to bring uh, a little tiny charge from way out here to infinity all the way to a half a meter away from the large charge right there.